Hey Libras, welcome back to my channel. So we're gonna get into it and do a quick little reading real quick. You know what I'm saying? It's super stuff I have. I send you guys love and light. I hope you guys are doing well. Thank you guys for joining me. Uh, if you have Libra in your chart, then you belong here. If you don't have Libra in your chart and you stumble upon this channel, then you belong here. Anything you need to know about me and the channel is in the description box below. So let's get into it and see what's the vibes. Shout out to my OG uh, viewers as well as any new viewers and subscribers. Thank you guys. I appreciate you guys. Welcome to the family and all of that good shit. Okay. So that girl will by and I started hearing she keeps on passing me by. Remember that song by the far side? I believe it still was. So maybe uh, someone sees you in passing. Someone wants to talk to you. They keep seeing you in passing. And you just keep on passing them by. But they like you. I think they like you. So let's see. What is the messages here? We have the four pentacles. So you guys could be holding back from someone. You guys could also be shopping. Someone could see you while you're shopping or see you in passing. They think you're sexy. They think your body is sexy. They think you uh, you got it like that, right? It's giving an energy of, of spending money. You look like money. You smell like money. What are the messages here from my leaders? They talk about you a lot, too. Look, single, sexy, abundant, and free. Right? Someone that got that pay box. Somebody that got that sh money bag. Somebody's definitely seeing you out shopping or seeing you go into the store. What are the messages here for my Libras? Masculine or feminine? Five of Cups. So this could be somebody that is in regret or start having sorrow over you. This person could definitely be doing a lot of talking about you as well. Why is this person in the Five of Cups? What about the Five of Cups? Oh, they don't want y'all to know. They don't want to come out. Why are they in the Five of Cups? What about the Five of Cups? What about the Five of Cups? Seven of Cups. Maybe they feel like you have options. This person could also be seeing you... Uh, at lunch, they could also want to take you on a date, right, Libra? They also want you to cook them a meal or they want to cook you a meal. But it's like they're in regret because you have options or there was some type of illusion going on. But I think they want success with you or they just see you as successful and uh, somebody that's very fashionable as well. I think they like the way you dress the way you look. They definitely got their eye on you. And this person is in regret over options or some type of illusion. So let's see. What's the Seven of Cups? Why is the Seven of Cups here? Two of Wands. So definitely somebody trying to have patience and wait. They see you as happiness. This person wants an equal give and take with you. So I really feel like this is you, you're single, and this person is wanting an opportunity with you. We have the Knight of Cups. They definitely want to date you. They want to take you out for coffee. They want to date you. Look, they see you. They be like, oh, shit. There she go. Looking good. What about the Knight of Cups? The Magician. So this person could definitely, um, ooh, ten of swords. Be careful of this person. This person could be a manipulator. This person could be somebody um, that is gonna end up backstabbing and betraying you. This person could possibly uh, already be in a situation and they wanna put you in a third party. But this person sees you very attractive, right? Queen of swords, big Libra energy. They want an opportunity with you. This could be a cancer for some of you guys. Also, you guys could be moving forward. You could be watching your ships come in. This person, this magician. Hold on, y'all. Let's see what's going on with this magician. It's like, get your hand out my pocket. This person is definitely watching you. 
all right? Because um, when I take this out of my pocket, it's the page of swords on the bottom of the deck. So somebody is definitely watching you. Look, seven of swords. Look, look at Otis ass. Y'all know I call that Otis now. Clarify this magician. We have the death here. So there could be some type of rebirth or look, new love. Somebody could want to transform something with you. Maybe for some of you guys, this could be somebody from your past. Clarify death. The queen of cups. So uh, someone that sees you has a sweetheart, loving and caring. Empress, two of cups, uh, backstab and betrayal, and left out in the cold. And discontent and boredom, waiting. So this could definitely be somebody that backstab and betrayed you multiple times. This person also sees you as someone that knows your worth, someone that is careful of who they date. Clarify the two of wands. We have judgment. So someone could definitely be under judgment for being manipulative to you. Maybe they turned their back on you to watch their ships come in or you turned your back to watch your ships come in. And this person is now in regret. This person is definitely going through a transformation. This person could have been somebody that was very manipulative and now they're in this Queen of Cups energy, emotionally uh, stable, emotionally mature, someone that is... Uh, caring and loving maybe they want to come and give you their cup of love and show you how they feel clarify judgment we have the eight of wands so this person could definitely uh want to communicate with you or they see that you're getting uh you're getting good things happening for you at this time. The rapid change. Spirit said that's a fact, okay? So this person, again, um, could be under judgment or you're just patiently waiting. Eight of Wands, rapid change, forward movement. So also someone could want a forward movement. Maybe someone is trying to move past illusions. Also, someone could be watching you online in some type of way. Clarify the Eight of Wands. We have the hard font here. And the Ten of Cups. So somebody definitely wants a higher level of commitment with you, a Ten of Cups situation. You guys could also be having rapid change as the spiritual leader, right? Your dreams are being fulfilled. Wishes are coming true for you at this time. Focus on your money. You hold it back. You're sacrificing and letting things go. Maybe someone is, like I said, in regret for being manipulative and having options. And now they're under judgment. This could be a fire sign for some of you guys. This person could definitely want to travel towards you. Clarify the hard font. By the fire font, we have the fool. So somebody definitely wanting a, a new start, a new beginning. Somebody could possibly want to turn their back on a family for a two of cups. It's going to cause some type of chaos and conflict. But this person is still coming through and offering you their cup of love. So someone, like, they about to call you, they like, hello? For some of you guys, this could be a Taurus, this could be a Pisces, this could be a Scorpio, this could be a Cancer, this could be a Earth sign. Clarify the food. So we have the, the Nine of Wands and the Star. So someone definitely could want to heal their relationship with you at this time. They want to pour into you. You see them, they started going crazy over there playing ping pong. Nine of uh, cups. So they see you as wish fulfillment and they want to heal the situation. So let's see, y'all. I think they done. 
again, the letter beside themselves. Okay, so let's see. This person sees you wish fulfillment. So again, this person could want to take you on a date. They could want to take you out for drinks, coffee, ice cream. They definitely just want a fresh start with you. So let's see. Page of Wands and the Emperor here. So someone definitely wants to communicate with you, give you good news. Someone could also want to send you something, send you a package. This, this is definitely someone that puts you in a third party. This could be a fire sign. Aries, uh, could be an Aries for some of you. The Emperor is an Aries or a Taurus. Clarify this page of wands and the emperor. We have the high priestess here. So someone trying to use their intuition. Someone is definitely unhappy and discontent and bored of my work. For some of you guys, you could be a high priestess and you could be in discontent and bored of my work. You focused on your money, but maybe you want to have the strength to uh, maybe try something different. This is giving me the vibes of, uh, what's that movie with J-Lo? She was like, a uh, 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 um, administrative assistant or something like that and then she was walking dogs it's like she was like a tent all over the place not really um, like in a real free spirited type of energy so someone could definitely be in, in regret right feeling left out in the cold when it comes to you this emperor it's like you got your head down working or this person can have their head down working this person has a lot of passion for you but there's definitely some type of devil energy or someone is under judgment for being toxic for having options for being just like trash all across the board right clarify the five of principles your favorite color could be red Yellow, what about the five of We have the two of cups. So somebody's going to left out in the cold from the two of cups. Oh, yeah, I can't. I'm going to have to run this one back. I think it was like so much noise. So the, it was the four swords because it fell in the upright. This person is wanting to heal this at this time. After this ending, some of you guys are definitely uh, traveling the world or being seen all around the world. You're getting uh, your wishes fulfilled with the will of fortune. Somebody definitely wants to give you equal give and take. So let's get you guys some advice because I'm going to end this. Pardon the noise. Let me know if it was too much in the comments. And I won't record here in this spot anymore. Last time I did, you guys said it was okay. So let's see. What is the advice here for my Libra collective? You got a passion in new beginning. And then we have the nine of pentacles. <clears throat> Someone's definitely trying to manifest you. They're trying to have patience. Someone could be single and they're wanting a passion in the beginning with you at this time. Someone could also be divinely guided towards you at this time for a fresh start and a higher level of commitment. So I feel like this person has a lot of love for you and they feel left out in the cold or they feel like they left you out in the cold, right? And you're just queen of cups. What is the advice here? Also guys, uh, you have a passion in the beginning that can make you very abundant. <clears throat> we have the world here. So for some of you guys, I feel like, um, it's like some of you guys completed something. You learned the lesson, you completed it, and now you have somebody that wants to rush towards you and give you an offer of a stable, reliable offer. They see you as the king of swords, and they want a new uh, cycle in love with you, or you guys could be getting a new cycle in love at this time from the divine. So also the advice is here, victory and success. Continue to move forward. Some of you guys need to pursue a passion that you have because it will bring you a lot of abundance. You will be uh, known worldwide. For, for some of you guys, you will be traveling. If you are traveling, um, make sure you guys are using wise counsel 
take that as that resonates for some of you guys traveling is going to bring you uh a king of swords energy or you're this king of swords and it's going to bring you new love so when you're traveling be open-minded about meeting someone new that could possibly end up being your uh forever love right and then for some of you, you have somebody wanting to come back to you from the past and offer you something. So make sure you guys are using your intuition. Don't hold back with this uh, passion in the beginning here. Spirit is wanting you guys to know. And then definitely somebody is spying on you. Somebody is spying on you, seeing you as abundance, and they're trying to manifest communication with you. So just so you know. In case you ain't know, now you know. Thank you guys for joining me, and I'll see you in the next one.